Hey guys, it's Krutika. Welcome back to my channel. First things first, we just hit 200,000 subscribers on this channel. I am so excited. Thank you so much to every single person who subscribed because the life that I'm getting to live now and all the traveling that I get to do is honestly all thanks to you guys. So thank you so 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 much. This really means a lot to me. And secondly, I just launched my online store and that's what this video is going to be about. So at the moment on my online store, I'm basically selling my Lightroom presets which are the exact presets I use to edit my photos and I'll talk more about it later in this video. But I plan to introduce other products as well in the future and if you guys want to get discounts before the products launch be sure to go and subscribe to my newsletter you can just click the link in my description to go to my store scroll all the way to the bottom and sign up for the newsletter there so in case you watched my last video or if you're following me on instagram you might already know about my store i launched it a couple of days ago and a lot of you had questions about uh, the presets and how they work so i thought i'll make a separate video about it so many of you have already bought and downloaded the presets i'm also giving away a free preset on my website so a lot of you have downloaded that as well i think in total about 850 people have already downloaded the presets which is amazing i wasn't expecting that so thank you so much to everyone who's downloaded i hope you guys are enjoying using the presets but in case you don't know about the store or if you don't know how presets work this video is going to explain all of that so let's start by explaining what lightroom presets are Lightroom is basically a software by Adobe which is what most professionals use to edit their photos. In fact, a lot of influencers and Instagrammers use Lightroom as well. And in the past, I've used apps like Snapseed, Visco, pretty much all the apps out there. But I think Lightroom is honestly the best. Also, it's actually a free mobile app. The desktop version is paid but the mobile app is free and my presets work with the free version of mobile app so that's awesome. So presets are basically like filters. So you know how Instagram or like all these other apps have filters to edit your photos. Presets are sort of like that but these are created by me. So these will help you edit your photos the way I do and I think in under a minute you will get some amazingly edited photos. So that's what presets do. I have been working on my presets for many months now. In fact, more than a year I think and I've developed these presets after a lot of hard work. I've fine-tuned them so that they work with all different kinds of photos and they work with JPEG, RAW, different formats, whether you've clicked it on your phone or your cameras. And the good thing is that I'm running a launch discount sale. So for the next one week, there's a sale going on. So in case you're interested in buying presets or even trying out the free preset, click the link in my description to check it out. A lot of people wanted to know what presets I have. So let me quickly explain what the different kinds of presets I have are. So I have have four main preset collections the city collection the summer collection winter collection and lifestyle collection and as the name suggests each of these preset collections works for those kind of photos so for example if you have a shot of the beach or if you have a shot of the desert then the summer collection works best for that if you have a shot of the city and buildings and architecture then maybe the city collection will work best if you have shots of mountains and snow then the winter collection and if you just have shots of like indoor shots portraits cafes and those kind of things food then the lifestyle collection works well but having said that a lot of these presets will actually work through different types of categories so for example sometimes my summer presets work well with my mountain shots and my city presets work well with like cafe and lifestyle type shots so you don't need all these different packs uh, you can just buy one of these packs and that should be able to help you edit those kind of photos each of these collections have 11 presets each and if you go to my website and click on that particular collection you can actually see the before after shots of each of these 11 presets so that will give you an idea of what kind of effects these presets have so do check that out apart from that i also have a starter pack so if you're new to presets don't really know how presets work then uh, this is a good place to start this pack has four of my most used presets so if you uh, download that you'll get those four presets and of course you can download the free preset as well so that's five presets in total and apart from this i also have a master collection which is what most of you seem to be buying so this is a collection of all all 44 of my presets and I think if you really want to take your photography and editing to the next level then this is the best collection. Right now it's at a 40% discount so I think it's at an amazing price. You get uh, each preset for less than 70 rupees which I think is awesome. A lot of you also wanted to know how to install these presets. So firstly when you download any of these preset packs including the free preset pack you will get three different things. One is the mobile preset. Second is the desktop presets, uh, which I'm giving you along with this as well. And uh, you'll also get an installation guide, which has step-by-step -step instructions on how to install these presets. 
Apart from this, I've also put up stories on my Instagram uh, giving you like a video tutorial of how to install these presets. So do check that out. So yeah, long story short, I'm putting out all my presets on the internet and you guys can get your hands on them and edit your photos the way I do. Also in my last YouTube video, I actually explained the whole process of how I edit step by step without using presets. So in case you're interested, you could check that out as well. I'll leave a card over here. So yeah, that's pretty much all I had to say. I hope you guys have an idea of what presets are. Basically, they help you edit your photos better and also reduce your editing time because you can edit your photos in honestly under a minute that's how long it takes me now because I use my presets I thought I'll quickly edit some photos and show you guys so I'm gonna show a couple of my photos and you guys also sent in some photos so I'm gonna quickly edit and show you guys uh, how this editing process works and show you how quick it actually is to edit these photos okay so let me open up Lightroom and hide all this mess uh, behind my phone screen so as you can see, I have a bunch of different photos already imported and I'm going to quickly edit and show you these photos. So the first one is a photo of me and as you can see, it's a very beachy summery vibe. So I'm going to look at my summer presets. So these are my summer presets and again, this depends on your preference, uh, what I like, you may not like. So I've designed each preset pack so that at least a couple of presets will work with every photo. So this looks nice. I really like this as well. Oh, I like Desert Rose for this as well. But I think the one I would choose is actually Tropical Vibes because it adds a nice warmth to the photo. So this is what it looks like. This is the before and this is the after. It literally took like a few seconds to find the preset which works for this. And after this, if you want to make some changes, make the photo darker, brighter, change any of the color tones, you can go into your Lightroom settings and do that. Moving on to the next photo. So as you can see, this is a photo of me out in the city. And uh, I think I will use my city presets for this. So let's go into my city collection and again I have 11 different presets, I'm going to try a bunch of them. This looks nice, cafe is a bit dark for this photo I feel. This looks nice as well but I'll have to reduce the brightness a bit I think. I think sunny day would look really nice on this. Yep I was right, I think I really like the look of this photo. This is the before and this is the after. How easy was that? Just with one click you get some amazing results. Next we have this beautiful photo of Taj Mahal. I actually really like this photo and because this is a city architecture type shot, I'm going to use my city presets. So let's go into city. Okay, we've got this. Cafe, city lights, Colourpop. Ooh, I really like Colourpop so I think I'm going to go with Colourpop. Now I feel like the sky would look nicer if it's a little more blue so I'm gonna go into my color mix, go to blue and reduce the luminance, increase the saturation and there you go that made the sky a little bluer and I think this looks so much nicer. So this is what the edited version looks like. Next we have a portrait. So again for my portraits I feel like my lifestyle uh, presets work best so let's go into lifestyle Let's see which one looks good. I feel like a lot of them. Oh, I actually really like Bali vibes. Coffee looks nice too. Cool tones is a little too white, but you can always reduce the exposure and highlights. Guys, all of these look really nice to me. So yeah, I think I would go with any of these honestly. I like fashion and I like Bali vibes. So yeah, I think this looks great. This is the before, this is the after. And of course, depending on your Insta feed or depending on what you're editing for or what look you want to go for, you can just choose uh, which of these presets work for you and make some minor tweaks and that's all you have to do, you're good to go. Next, we have this photo of a beach. Now this, as you can see, is super dark. The water looks blue, the colors are nice, but it's super dark. So uh, of course, because this is a beach photo, I'm going to go into my summer presets and Try out and see which one looks good. This is Beach Bum, Blue Lagoon, Desert Rose, Dreamy Sunset. I actually like Dreamy Sunset. Now, even after using the preset, you can see this photo is still dark. So we're going to make some minor adjustments now. So I'm going to increase the shadows, increase the exposure a little bit, increase the highlights as well. and. Just with that, you can see it has made quite a big difference. I might put in some more time and make it even better. This is the before and this is the after. Such a big difference with just a few clicks. 
So that's how you edit using presets. I hope this video was useful and I'm super excited to be sharing my presets with you guys. Like I mentioned, I have a free preset as well. So in case uh, before buying the presets, you want to try it out and see what it's like, uh, then you can do that as well. The link to the website is in the description box and I would love to see your edits using my presets. So be sure to use uh, hashtag Kritika Goyal presets and I've also created another Instagram account where I'm going to share editing tutorials and tips and show you before after shots. So if you want to follow that, that, uh, that's Kritika Goel presets. Before I end this video, again, thank you so, so, so much for 200,000 subscribers. It really means a lot. I had a few things in mind, honestly, uh, for 200k, but now that none of us can travel, uh, I'm just spending it at home, but can't really complain. I hope you guys are staying safe as well and staying home. The lockdown has been extended again, so uh, I'm going to be posting a lot of vlogs from home. If you have any recommendations of videos, let me know. If you have any questions about my presets, uh, then you can just message me on instagram or comment here and i will get back to you thanks so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it give it a like leave a comment subscribe to my channel press the bell button and i will see you guys next time bye